Today, we are going to be shopping for light blue fidgets only at Learning Express. And guys, I am so excited because light blue is one of my very favorite colors. I just think it is so beautiful and it reminds me so much of cotton candy. Now, I can't just buy any shade of blue. It has to be light blue slash pastel blue, sky blue, whatever you want to call it. But before we get started, I have a challenge for all of you watching. I want to see if you guys can like, click subscribe, and turn on that post notification bell in just five seconds. I hope you guys are ready because here goes the countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. Time's up. If you guys were successfully able to complete the five second challenge, then I want you to comment down below a ton of light blue emojis. As a matter of fact, see if you can comment all of the light blue emojis that exist. I want to see if anyone can do it. I challenge you. Yes, you right there. But all right, you guys, so without further ado, we are going to go inside right now and find every light blue fidget that we can. And I hope that you'll enjoy watching. And P.S. Okay, make a prediction of how many you think I'm going to find. My guess is... Ooh, I gotta be realistic, but also optimistic. So we're gonna say 15. I bet we'll find 15 light blue fidgets. Let's go. Here we are, the iconic Learning Express store. Christmas in July, yes. <gasps> There's me, you guys. There's me. Oh my goodness. Meet and greet July 31st. <sighs> All right, you guys. So I have my basket ready to go. And as always, we are going to start in the front of the store. I already see something blue, but this isn't really light blue. And again, we're being really, really specific because I've done tons of blue fidget shopping challenges before, but this one is a little trickier because it has to be a specific shade of blue. So if it looks like it matches my shirt, then it's a yes, but if it's darker, then it's a no. So we're gonna pass on the couch. Let's see, no blue over here. Ooh, okay, what do you guys think about this? It's a little 3D pop it video game controller. So I know it's not like 100% light blue, but look, I feel like it has quite a bit of light blue in it. I think we should count this, but comment below if you guys think that's fair or not. So now we're gonna curve around this way. <gasps> guys, I'm obsessed with these. They are little sports ball PBJs. And so I'm really stumped about this one. Should we count it or not? Because obviously the baseball isn't blue, but the inside, look at those Orbeez. They are so beautiful and they're the perfect shade of light blue. I don't know. I feel like if I saw this though, I would say that's white. So we're going to leave that there. Would you have counted this? Yes or no? A fidget spinner. This one's very, very unique and it's definitely light blue. We are going to add this. Look at this giant wall of fidgets over here, though, you guys. Okay, so this is super duper satisfying. There's like glitter in the middle and it has a really fun texture. This is just regular blue, though, not necessarily light blue. See, that's why this challenge can be super duper tricky. No blue pop tubes. We could definitely count this. Oh, I see blue. Let's see. It's not the majority, though. So we're going to put him back and keep looking. We've got tons of these. Oh my goodness, these are so fun. They do have a blue, but it's not light blue. Ooh, okay, we just hit the jackpot. This is like the perfect shade of light blue. It is so pretty. Even though the fidget itself is kind of scary because it's a centipede. Question for you guys, should this count? It's super cool. This is a water snake with like a stingray inside. I've never seen this one before. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put it in the basket and see if it matches everything else. And if it does, then we will say yes. And I'm kind of feeling like it's matching pretty well. So I think that one is a keeper. So I was hoping that they would have a blue shimmer stress ball because I did get one around Easter time and it would have been perfect for this challenge, but I only see orange, green, and yellow. So that's okay because we still have plenty of store to look through. And then look at this little dice, you guys. Okay, this definitely counts because yes, there is a little bit of dark blue, but the majority is light blue. It has a super duper pretty marble design. We're gonna add this. So I completely forgot about this back corner over here, but I don't really see anything in our color anyway, except they might have a light blue Bingsu stress ball. These are so cool. They come in pink, white, and blue. As you guys can see though, these ones are clear, so I don't see any light blue, but there's a chance that they might have some over there. So let's go check it out. So we have another white, 
another white and pink oh man literally they are sold out of light blue and i could see why that one is definitely the prettiest and my favorite color is light pink but i'm telling you the light blue being sue stress ball is stunning there is light blue in here but it's only like 25 percent of it and you guys know the deal has to be at least 50 percent or over so ooh, okay but we just hit the jackpot over here these are so fun for summer they're these little squishy sea creatures and look at this jellyfish you guys it feels so weird touching it because even though it's just a squishy toy i always feel like it's gonna sting me or something <laughs> like if you see one of these washed up on the beach or in the water don't touch it so we're gonna get that one and then also there is a light blue starfish and i could be going crazy but i swear these are two different shades of blue what do you guys think i feel like this one is a bit lighter and this one is a little darker i don't know i can't tell what do you guys think should i get both of these or just one of them i don't know this is a close call i think i'll probably just get one of them we'll go with this one this is a little bit lighter and then there's also these frogs but i feel like that's not really light blue it's just kind of like a regular shade of blue okay this little octopus i've never seen this one before it's like turquoise so that's really pretty we already got the jellyfish so okay we got all the light blue stuff over here Ooh, wait okay so these are super duper cool they're little stress balls and they remind me of boba tea so i know they do have blue see look on the back that's one that they show oh my gosh it is so pretty you guys i only own one of these and it's pink so let's see if we can find blue okay they're kind of pretty as you can see but we're gonna keep looking maybe we'll find the blue one for this challenge All of them were green so we will not be getting one of those however okay we're gonna come over here because we are not done yet you guys we still have so much to look through they have these little mini pop it change purses and oh my goodness this one is seriously so perfect wow honestly one of my favorite colors so let's add this and also let's take a second to just admire how beautiful this basket looks so far. I'm obsessed. They have these little Crocs and I feel like this is more of like an indigo, not really a light blue. So we're gonna leave that there. And then we have so many of these little BFF dimple keychains. It always feels really weird just buying one and not the other, but since it is a color challenge, that's what we gotta do. So we're going to get this soy sauce one. Usually goes with the sushi, but what do you guys think? Actually, is this light blue? Look at it. Mm, I don't know. I feel like most of it's white, but right where its face is, it looks light blue. So that's that's a tough call, but I'm going to say no. Let's see. Would this one count? I think this one would totally count because the pop it bubble is light blue. And they do know for sure that there is a light blue slime. It's called Blueberry Dreams. And I heard a lot of good things about this one. I don't actually own it myself, but I definitely want to try it. So today is the perfect day to do that. Now we're going to check out this back section. I don't really think there's going to be anything in our color. A little too dark, but still really cool. This is also a little too dark. Oh man, you guys. See, this is why it's tricky. If I was just doing general shades of blue, uh, this would have been filled up like a long time ago. But you know what? I can't complain because we are doing really well so far. And I'm definitely most excited for this line. And also... I really love this pop it change purse because it is just such a beautiful color. I almost forgot about these. Okay, so these are a fairly new fidget. They are these little 3D animal poppets, and this fox is just the cutest, and he is light blue. I think this is absolutely adorable, and he needs to come home with us. Also, there's this shark, and eh, I feel like he's not really light blue. He is really, really cool but we are going to pass on him and now we're in the crazy Aaron section oh my gosh wait this is new this is beautiful oh my goodness i could start this for hours and this is in our color look even though it says rainbow the packaging honestly is very very light blue so we'll add this hmm okay what do you guys think about this one technically yes the putty is clear 
but the actual tin is light blue. It's like light blue and yellow. I am so on the fence about this. It's 50, 50, ah, I don't know. I wouldn't count this for yellow and I also wouldn't really count it for light blue. So we are just going to let it stay in the store. And now on the side, there's so many of these cool little hide and seek putties. I'm obsessed. They do have two blues, but these are the opposite of light blue. These are very dark blue. We also have so many of these tie-dye little suction bracelets. I was gonna say pop-it bracelets, but no, look. I'll show you guys on the table. Hey, there's me. Okay, we'll try it right next to it. It sticks to the table and it's really, really, really satisfying. Honestly, you guys, I think I underestimated how many fidgets we would find today because we are still not done. We haven't looked up here yet. These are just the cutest things ever. They're called squishy snacks and I really, really, really hope they have a light blue one because they are so cute. Look at their little faces. I am in love, honestly. I'd really love to come back and just get one of each of all of them because they are so fun. I love them, but none of them are in our color, so let's keep going. Okay, we are going to count this globe stress ball. I swear I have like seven of these at home because I've gotten so many fidget mystery boxes and they always have these inside. I guess that'll make eight now. We're gonna look at the Nitos. These are mostly neon. I don't really think there's gonna be any pastels. Ooh, but there is a light blue one right here. And the packaging is light blue too. So we're going to count it. All right, and then there is one more little section back here, you guys. And I have been wanting this for forever. Look at this, it's a slow rising little baby bottle squishy and it has like cow print on it which is so cool. I already have the black and white one from when I did a black only fidget shopping challenge. So now we have the baby blue one as well. You guys know what time it is. It is time to go to the counting corner and see just how many we were able to find. And if you haven't already made your predictions of how many we found today, make sure you pause the video and comment below your guesses. All right, you guys. So we have made it to the iconic counting corner. And I believe my OG guess was that we would find 15 light blue fidgets. So let's count them up and see how close we were. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. I underestimated by two fidgets. So guys, comment below how close you were, but I am honestly super happy with everything that we found. And if I had to choose a favorite item, it would definitely have to be this crazy Aaron's putty. It's called Rainbow Putty. This is just so stunning. I don't even wanna take it out of the packaging. Comment below you guys, which item you would wanna steal from this pile. My top three are definitely this one this slime, and also probably the starfish. And that is a wrap for this light blue only fidget shopping challenge at the one and only Learning Express in Wexford, PA. If you guys like this video, then please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and let me know if I should come back and do a light pink only fidget shopping challenge because A, I've never done it before, and B, that is literally my favorite color ever. And it would totally coordinate with this challenge because light blue and light pink are literally cotton candy colors. So let's get this video to 12,000 thumbs up if I should come back and do a light pink only version. Version, but I love you all to the minute back. Thank you again for watching and I will talk to you in the next video. Bye. Mwah.